to get around my walls after us, so you're going to like that. But anyway, uh, no, and I'm glad. I'm glad we have an Awana program here at um, Fellowship. Um, for those that don't know, I came all the way up to the Awana program. So with, back when I was in Awana, it was pals and pioneers. We didn't have uh, tea and tea, um, but we had pals and pioneers, chumps and guards. And then we didn't have a JD varsity program, but I did it on my own just to complete the entire WANA program. So I'm really, I'm really passionate about the WANA program. I actually helped start the WANA programs um, in two churches that did not have the WANA programs. The first church I was a youth pastor in, the first thing I did was start a youth Bible study. The second thing I did was start the WANA program because I'm just a real big advocate of the WANA program. And there's not a program out there that um, encourages children to, to learn God's Word and to memorize God's Word quite like the Iwana program uh, does. So what you guys have done over the last year, studying your verses, memorizing your verses, memorizing uh, the books of the Bible, and just learning God's Word from your teachers, it is an awesome thing, and it is uh, certainly something to be celebrated. And, uh, and that is what we're here to do tonight, is to celebrate all your accomplishments. And looking, looking at this back table here, there was a lot of verses uh, memorized uh, this year. So I just want to congratulate all of you uh, on doing that. Um, I want to thank the leaders. I want to thank uh, the Reese family and, and for heading this up this year. And uh, for all the other leaders that have worked on this this year you showed up every sunday night you have prepared lessons you've helped kids memorize the verses prepared snacks ran games um i just want to just want to thank all those adults that, that had a part in that um you know if you look at their scripture uh jesus was very serious when it came to children uh, there were some serious consequences if you didn't look after these children. And that's what we're trying to do here at Fellowship Baptist Church is just look after them, keep them safe, and pour into them uh, God's Word. I think about the passage in the Bible when uh, the disciples tried to send the children away. And Jesus kind of reprimanded them. He said, wait a minute, guys, wait a minute. And uh, he ushered for them to bring the children uh, close to them. And I think children are, are near and dear. Uh, to the heart of God, and certainly they're near and dear to the, the heart of people here at Fellowship Baptist Church. And one way in which we do that is, of course, uh, the Awana program. Also, want to thank the parents and grandparents and aunts and uncles uh, that made sure they were here. Uh, we could not minister to them if you guys did not get them here. Right? Even our TNTs aren't driving yet. None of you guys are driving, right? Oh, okay, I got them. Okay, whatever. Uh, anyway. Uh, but I, I thank you for getting the children here and making sure that they're here week after week so they can learn about God's Word. Uh, it's been it's been exciting. I mean, you look, we've got quite a few children here, and there and I know there's some faces here that we are missing that are out here on Sunday nights because I slide out here on Sunday nights before Sunday night discussion to to see who's here, and I know we're missing uh, some of our children tonight. So there's more than what we see here, but we we have an awesome number here tonight. So I do want to thank you, parents uh, and grandparents and aunts and uncles and stuff, for making sure they have been here to the water program, where they can learn God's Word, where they can have some fun with some kids their age, and where they can learn God's Word and how to how to apply it. So, um, of course, most of you I look around, pretty much everybody knows me. I'm Pastor Dave. Uh, we do a lot. We do a lot here at our church for children. We, we try to minister to the whole family, but we do a lot for children. Uh, so if, you, if this is all you do here is the Iwana program, uh, and this is the only program you participate in, I encourage you to come out and, and be part of some of the other things we do. We've got some activities planned this summer uh, that are going to be some fun uh, for children. Our first one coming up on June the 30th. We're going to have some water activities here. We're going to have homemade ice cream here. Uh, and looking forward uh, to that, we've got a program on Wednesday nights. Kids Connect, they're going to have Wednesday nights. They're going to have a program for them because we wrapped up our Children's Choir uh, program this morning. What an awesome job that was. And once again, a lot of these guys were in the Children's Choir. And you guys did a phenomenal job this morning as far as singing your songs and, and uh, knowing your parts. I tell you what, when I got up there to preach this morning, I was seriously energized and excited 
And uh, I think it had to do with these children and the program that they gave this morning was just an awesome uh, job. So we do a lot. We do a lot with the children here. And uh, every Wednesday night we have a community meal. I encourage you to come out and uh, be part of that. Just a good time to get to know some of our church people and have a good time of food. So I'm not up here to preach. Just want to let you know that uh, that we love these children and it is a it is a pleasure. It is a a honor. Uh, and, and we don't take lightly the fact that you bring them here to us and leave them here with us a couple of hours on Sunday night and allow us to pour uh, into them. Once again, I want to thank all the volunteers. I'm not going to name everybody's names uh, because um, I will forget someone uh, for sure. But once again, God knows and, uh, and He will reward you uh, for your efforts. So, is that all we need?